assalamu alaikum hi everyone my name is zain and you are watching my youtube channel learn math in today's video we are going to solve these questions but before starting like the video and if you are new on my channel please subscribe it let's begin to solve these questions the first question is if each side of a square is increased by 25 percent find the percentage change in its area these are the four options let the side of the square is x so the area of the square will be x square according to the question each side of a square is increased by 25 percent so the side will be x plus 25 percent of x we can write it x plus 0.25 x 25 by 100 can be written as 0.25 x that is equal to 1.25 x the area of the new square will be 1.25 x whole square which is equal to 1.5625x square. Now change in the area is equal to the new area minus the original area. So 1.5625x square minus x square. And we will get 0.5625x square. Now the percentage change in the area is change in the area divided by original area multiplied by 100. Putting the values 0.5625x square divided by x square multiplied by 100 x square will be cancelled with x square and we will get 56.25 and the correct option is option b the second question is the mean of 50 observations was 36 it was found later that in observation 48 was wrongly taken is 23 the correct new mean is these are the four options is we know that mean is equal to sum of all observations divided by number of all observations so mean is 36 and number of observation is 50 multiply 50 with 36 and we will get sum of all observations is equal to 1800 now the correct sum is 1800 minus 23 because this is wrongly taken and we will add 48 so plus 48 is equal to 1825 now we will find the correct mean so the correct mean is equal to 1825 and divide by 50 number of observations which is equal to 36.5 and option b is the correct option the third question is a tank is 2 by 5 full if 16 liters of water is added to the tank it is become 6 by 7 full so the capacity of the tank is what these are the four options let the capacity of the tank is equal to x liters according to the question we can write 6 by 7 of x minus 2 by 5 of x is equal to 16 liters simplify this take lcm and we will get this multiply 35 with 16 and 30 minus 14 is 16 x we will get this cancel 16 with 16 and we can write x is equal to 35 so the correct option is option c the fourth question is the ratio of the father's age to the son's age is 3 ratio 1. The product of their ages is 147. The ratio of their ages after 5 years will be, these are the 4 options. Let the father's age is equal to 3x and the son's age is equal to x. So according to the question, the product is equal to 147. So we can write x multiplied by 3x is equal to 147. 3x square is this dividing both sides by 3 and we will get x square is equal to 49 x is equal to 7 now after 5 years so we can write the father's age after 5 years is 3x plus 5 put put x is equal to 7 and we will get 26 the son's age after 5 years will be x plus 5 put x is equal to 7 and we will get 12 so 26 ratio 12 Simplify and we will get 13 ratio 6. So the correct option is option D. The fifth question is The population of a town increased from 1,75,000 to 2,62,500 in a decade. What is the average percent increase of population per year? These are the four options. Increase in population in 10 years is equal to 2,62,500 minus 1,75,000. That is equal to 
87,500. Percent increase in population in 10 years is 87,500 divided by 1,75,000 multiplied by 100. Simplify this and we will get 50%. Now we have to find the average percent so divide by 10 because we have to find the average percent increase of population per year that is 5%. So the correct option is option A. Thank you so much.